as a range. You know what I mean? Because you have to be a little bit farther out or a little bit closer or whichever to get the conversions off of Razor Leaf, which means you have to be more anal about the spacing and you have to be more attentive to that. And it's not as big as a leeway, I suppose. So that is important for something like this where Rob can assert a lot of near full stage presence pretty easily with laser and top or gyro. I think I'm going to go uncontested when I say Powhatana probably wins this matchup. I think so. so it's not like clear cut because Rob's actually like kind of crazy. Yes. But I, 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 Powhatana just has so much going for her against big bodies and Rob is a really big robot. Yes, I will say one of the things that he does have going for him, uh, Palutena does a lot of work at the ledge, and you'll see there, Jen hit a very well-spaced back air onto okay. Dill's shield, and Dill was still able to counter with a jump out of shield fair, which is a very strong option, and one of the very, I guess, freest ways oh. to get himself off the ledge, which is a big part of this matchup. Don't cross so, that my shield, I'll up smash you. Yes. So I think it'll come down to, um, how Jen can make this work in the matchup of the ledge. I think if he can keep him off stage, because as good as Rob and Dill's disadvantage state is, it's still disadvantage. You have to get back to stage eventually. Um, and Palutena is one of the best at keeping people off. So if Jen can keep that consistently and not fall for the Rob tricks, I think he'll be able to take it, yes. I think it'll be in his favor at that yeah, point. looking really small. I, Dill does that so much, Very but, it's, it, but it's, always, uh, it's always tricky because it's always a different timing. So yes. you may expect it coming, but you never know when. Or he'll just grab ledge. Yes. It's very <laughs> strong, too, because if you block, say, the gyro or whatever move he blocks out, he typically just snaps the ledge right after. Yeah. So it's a very safe option to go for. You basically have to read it at the time he's going to toss it out. And the whole fuel mechanic, you're never in worry of running out of fuel since, like, Rob spends so much time on stage. And the actual fuel recovers much quicker than, like, like say, uh, Olimar's upbeat. Yes. It's like it, you're not going to you're not in any danger of running out of fuel unless you're recovering from literally the bottom blast zone. So speaking of recover, we're actually seeing Dill take back stage here. He's working at quite a large deficit. A uh, stray hit or two here will probably catching seal the stock, up. but he's catching up kind of quick. Yeah. A lot of these safe aerials on shield aren't really getting as much mileage anymore. Since Dill is much is willing to play is willing to like step back. Yes. And let Palutena fade back with her aerial and is like, okay, I'll step back and shoot top. Or I'll step back and like charge later. Mm -hmm. That's a very strong option here. Spacing it Neutral out. Get up. Oh nice. Yeah, outspacing the down tilt in order to, in order to get that punish. Hard to punish down tilt, but if you know what's coming, if you know if you know any move is coming, you can definitely say you can definitely uh, yes. capitalize. Uh, wow, he was still uh well, forward air wasn't a quick enough punish on that one, but that was pretty good. He was still safe on that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. so he is still connected. Yeah, he is. Yeah. He is a big boy, like it's you were so saying. Large. That's. It's one of the few weaknesses, right? Oh, that was a good read. <laughs> yeah, you know, Dill, Dill put his face in his hands. Shut me up. Oh, I'm so sorry to cut you off. No, 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 not you. Didn't shut me up. Jen did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> can we can we get a replay of that with Dill? Just like <laughs> I'm, watch, I'm watching Dill now. See, I'm wondering if he buffered, but he's just. <laughs> oh no! Can we emote that? <laughs> I've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> <laughs> there is a flaw in my plan. <laughs> oh, this uh, this will work. It didn't work. Oh. <laughs> okay, back to the match. All right. Smash Bros. a pick. Yep, going into game two. So I'm kind of interested on Dill's choice on this one. So uh, less less stage to uh, cover, mm -hmm. I suppose. So your zoning tools are going to be a bit more effective. Um, that middle platform is really handy for mm -hmm. uh, Rob combos. The blast zones are pretty small, so you'll kill with up to up air quicker. Uh, these I'm just spitballing, so maybe this is one of the reasons. Maybe Dill knows something secret, I and did he it got again. him again. He face he again, did it again. Too. He's not smiling this time, though. No, this time he's like, okay, time to fix. But right, time to time to zone. It's gamer mode time. One thing I will say, because I I kind of play zoner. He's not dead. Um, I play a character that can zone, right? And typically, if you're going to be zoned, you want a smaller stage, so you don't have to deal with it so much. But you still benefit from the fact that people um, are more likely to be within your zone if you have, you know, a smaller sort of area you project on. 
but smaller stage also means that if Dill gets hit at a lower percent, he's going to be off stage and in this edge guard scenario again. And Jen has been doing a really good job Caught the jump. as Jen is burning. I think that was he was trying to jump back air, but the uh, Rob's own back air was primed. Yeah. How are you how are you gonna back air intangibility through raw fiery plasma? Does that work? I don't feel like that should work. She is a goddess. She is a goddess. So the the laws of nature don't exactly apply. <laughs> Fair. Yep. Another that one. that actually is a small quirk that I did forget about. Doing the uh, I think that's Rob's down throw. Uh, it does get you on top throw. of that one. Oh, down, throw, throw? down throw berries. Up throw. That's right. Suplexes. That's right. that's right. So the up throw does take you to the top platform there, which can help with kill conversions. Yep. Yeah. It's the same as like Charizard up throw. Yes. Just so um. Dill, ooh, that was kind of... charged it in his face. Yep, that was kind of a saucy teleport cancel, but maybe not the most useful. Yo! No! I'm sorry, Devin, I hit the mic, but holy... <laughs> oh my god, that didn't just actually happen that way, did that? He was at zero. Was that real? He was at zero. No. I mean, like, I mean, like, optimal. No! Optimal. No. What else are you going to do there?